Hello everyone, this is my first video in 2018, so a very happy new year to all of you. It's been a long time since I uploaded a video, so let's get back to work. Today I want to show you how to create a video player controller and play video on it. So let's get started. This is what we will be creating. And uh, here I have a simple button which says play and when I hit play, it plays a video and we can change the orientation and if we just pull down it stops so very simple very fast let's get started so this is the uh, project which I already created uh, I have done uh, nothing in this project so let's first get the video here I have a video which says sample.mov uh, I basically recorded this on my iPhone and um, just uh, make sure this checkbox is checked and this one as well and you can say create groups and just match the options and say finish so in order to check that your video is played on your device so just let's have a simple check uh, so click on this project the blue thing the topmost root of your uh, this folder structure and we will go to build phases and here under copy bundle resources you should see your video so we are done with that part so let's hop over to our view controller first we need a button so let's get a button and drag and drop here and we'll say horizontally and vertically in center and a fixed width and height of let's say width will be uh, 200 and height of 65 not 665 and it should read play and I don't like this system font so let's change it to custom and this will be light and let's bump up the size to 50 and change the font color to white and background to gray okay and let's just connect the outlet so I'll just connect the outlet and say play rest and sorry for my font size I will just bump up the size hold on a second and I'll just say command comma and my YouTube font size and BAM you all can see so let's get to the coding part first we need the file path to our file so I will say if let file path and uh, this is a safe way of doing it so basically if you don't get the file path your application won't crash it will just print out some message okay so let's do that and we will say bundle dot main dot url and it, it should be for resource with extension and for resource will be it's of type string and here you will pass in your name of your file which is uh, mine says sample dot mov so for resource will be sample and extension will be mov and open parentheses and hit enter so I'll just add few spaces here and we don't need this as well and here uh, we got the URL so <coughs> now uh, first of all we need to import avkit so avkit and here we will say let video equal to av video or, or should I say av player and open brackets and here I will pass in the URL and this will be just the file path uh, which is already a URL file path and now we need a controller which is a video controller and I will say video controller and this will be AV player view controller and open close brackets and now we need to assign this controller our video and I will say video controller Oh, I did not say video controller and now I will say video controller dot player is equal to video simple oh 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 video and now we need to present this view controller simple present view controller and this will be a video controller and animated will be true so <coughs> let's keep completion uh, nil right now and I will show you a little trick after this so I will just hit play and this is my previous application so don't mind and this one is our new application and when I say play it shows the view controller but the video is not playing so I will just change the orientation and hit play so now we can play the video 
and let's get so what if you want the video to start playing as soon as the controller is popped okay so here get rid of nil and say open curly bracket and just hit enter and here we will say video dot play and let's run the application one last time and it should work so installing play it's playing the video orientation we get the sound okay I'll, I'll